Hamas has said if Israel goes into Gaza and starts going nuts, they'll start executing people on, on video. If they were to execute a U.S. hostage, how does that change the situation from, from a U.S. posture standpoint? Well, Mike Waltz is in charge. Uh, then then we, start, we start taking out Hamas with U.S. precision-guided weapons, and we can escalate from there. Uh, they've crossed a line. But remember, ISIS did this uh, under Obama. I mean, they were literally beheading Americans in orange jumpsuits, burning uh, pilots alive in cages. And, you know, I mean, we had, Obama had to be pushed to go deal with the, the JV team. So I, you know, I, I can tell you what I would do and what I will push for uh, us to do if that happens. Taking a step back, Sean, what I hope is happening right now, just working in the Middle East as, and Africa as long as I have as a Green Beret my, my whole career, the Egyptians are always the mediator here. I hope at a minimum, they are cutting a deal right now to at least get the women and children out. Yeah, uh, I, you know that uh, that get them out. But unfortunately, how Hamas, Taliban, Al Qaeda, all of them operate is they will have uh, for the poor Israeli soldiers and maybe the the U.S. hostages and others. They will have them chained to every potential military target in Gaza uh, because they're thugs, they're evil, uh, and they need to be eradicated from the earth. 